Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. I'm Clara and today I wanted to share with you the new Too Faced Diamond Light Highlighter. Now this is also called the Multi-Use Diamond Fire Highlighter and it was actually inspired by a diamond ring. The price of this is $34 and it does have 12 grams of product in it which is quite a lot. When you open it up there's a box within the box and it says it's your time to shine. So it's in this cushiony little pink box and it does have a tiny gold latch that you push to open. Inside the top is also kind of of cushion like and it says Too Faced so it's really reminiscent of a ring case. The highlighter inside is very iridescent which I like. It has green, purple, and blue colors in it and when they swirl together you kind of get like a lavender type shade. On my skin tone it doesn't pull as green because I am a little bit like an olive yellow skin tone um, so mostly on me I see like the blue and the purple. This highlighter has no smell and compared to their previous Love Light highlighter release I do prefer this one because I feel like it's a little bit more in intense and buildable. The other one on me wasn't quite as buildable so I do feel like this one is more of an intense highlighter. And you can see a heavy swatch on my hand which kind of gives you an idea of how blue it looks. The packaging is a magnetized cardboard and unfortunately it doesn't come with a mirror inside which is my only complaint. I do think that this highlighter would look best on either somebody who wants a really intense kind of standout highlighter um, or people who have very fair skin tones, especially people who have a pink pinker or cooler toned skin. Because my skin is so yellow with a little bit of green in it, the blue of the highlighter does stand out quite strongly and it does look a little bit unnatural. So it just depends on what kind of highlight you like. I do really like the iridescent finish of it, especially when applied with a kind of light hand. But for those of you who are looking for like a really subtle natural highlight, this maybe is not it. That being said, I do really enjoy this highlighter. I was actually considering doing our next giveaway of this highlighter, depending on what you guys think. Um, our giveaway of the Tarte Foil Finger Paints palette is ending on January 15th. So if you haven't seen that, just please check out the link in the description box below to enter. And um, let me know what you guys think. Is this something you'd be interested in for our next giveaway? And if you guys are curious what's on my eyes, it is the thing that I'm gonna be reviewing Viewing and posting later this week for you and that is the Kat Von D mini metal mattes palette. I saw a lot of looks online using like the warmer orange shades of the palette so I really wanted to use the berries and this is just the look that I came up with. And anyway that's it for our super quick review of this little highlighter, actually not so little highlighter. Um, let me know what you guys think about doing this as our next giveaway and I'll talk to you again really soon. Bye guys!